Hi, David Shermet again with another one of those questions that you should be asking as a small business person, but you probably aren't. I've talked in previous videos about the consultants that you need. One of those consultants may not actually be a consultant, maybe someone who you need inside of the business, someone I call the office manager. Earlier this year, I went out and got my project management certification, my PMP, from the Project Management Institute. And those skills are very important skills to bring into your organization. They're really a lot of what I would call the blocking and tackling, to use a football term, of running your business. It's not about sales, necessarily. It's not about, it's not about vision or anything else. It's how we get things done. How do you approach problems? How do you analyze them? How do you make sure that everything that needs to be taken care of and addressed within a specific project, within a specific set of goals, is getting done? Well, the project management skill, which I call an office manager in the context of a small business, is someone who is very critical to that success. That person, when you bring them in, can help you establish procedures systematize things that are happening in your office from hiring and firing to how the office looks to how we're going to have a new sales approach we're launching a new product all of these skills are very useful and when it comes to bringing that person in that person can take a lot of the logistical questions off of your desk that is an important critical thing so that you as the business owner can concentrate on vision can concentrate on the big meetings, making sure that everything is happening behind you. But in order to do that, you have to have the right team. And actually, the right office manager can make sure and at least help you get that right team in place. So the person to think about today is the office manager. And what sort of characteristics would you like to see in the right office manager? Well, to help you out, down below, I've included in the description a link that will provide you some of that information. And I hope that it's helpful to you. Um, I look forward to hearing back from you on this, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video where I'm going to ask you another question that you should be asking in the context of your small business. Thank you.